Hello, this is Liz from ReviewHarbor.net and today we're going to have a look at an Android app called Duplicate Files Fixer. This app will help you find and delete duplicate files from your Android phone or tablet. Well, the interface is very clear and gives you several options. You can scan for duplicate audio files, duplicate videos, pictures and documents. You can also do a full scan which is what I'm going to do now. That's a very interesting progress wheel and here we go, here are the duplicates. Groups and uh, one of the files or several files are already pre-selected. I'm not sure how the app selects and uh, the duplicates and um, determines which one is the original file but still you can review the path click on a file you can open the file well, I'm not going to do that now and inspect the duplicates okay so this is not bad this looks alright uh, but I can immediately see several problems. I can't see the full path, so I'm not sure which one to keep and which ones to delete. And uh, there seems to be quite a few of the system files, the DAT files. Uh, I mean, I just review software and apps. I'm not a developer, I'm not a software expert to that point. So this looks that there are some app files like Aeroflot files, color note files, and I'm kind of afraid that deleting one of them or several of them could harm my device. Yes, true, there is a backup now button, so I could run a backup and uh, Oh, but that, that takes me to do, install another app. I don't like that. I don't like that at all. I wish they would be clearer about that. So I'm going to get back. And uh, let's have a look at the options now. I'll just... Let's have a look at the settings. Okay, so there are filters. Same content. That's good because this ensures that we're actually deleting the exact duplicates so there can be no mistake. And there is the ignore list. Now I've already added Android to it and Android secure resources because I wasn't comfortable about deleting the duplicates there. Click on tap on the add button and find a folder that you'd like to um, add to the ignore list, for example, data. I'll do that. Finish. There it is. We've added it. Okay, let's go back to the scan. And now I'm just going to scan for pictures because I'm not comfortable about deleting other files. And it's funny because it didn't find any pictures, although the full scan finds some pictures from Viber. And that's a bit ridiculous. That's some cover art because they are pictures. Okay, so overall this is a nice looking app, but it clearly needs some work. And uh, I'd love to see some security features that adds to the ignore list automatically as the folders that could be dangerous to meddle with. And I'd love to see the full path of each duplicate file. 